Oh, what's going on guys, my name is Zodiac and welcome back to Psychonauts. Last time we left off we got our levitation badge thingy so we can do this now. And whatever's okay. in here. I'm a certified levitator now. Ready to roll. Hmm. I've been running some tests. It seems that the sensitive circuitry of the brain tumbler is picking up too much psychic interference to be safe. The thoughts of some other entity are interlacing with yours at a dangerous level, which explains many of the strange things you've seen. I must call off the experiments until we know more. Sasha, there's no time. I think my vision about Dogen came true. I'm worried it's gonna happen to the others if we don't get to the bottom of this quick. But we don't know where the foreign projections are coming from yet. Is there a faster way to find out than sending me in there to investigate? Damn right, Sasha. Okay. What the fuck is that? Oh yeah. Let's go climb the thing. So where am I going? Over here, presumably. Why are you screaming? All right, I remember. The whole brain thing, probably. <laughs> Pepper. <laughs> oh, good boy. There's that pesky brain. Here's a tissue. Now. Don't you feel better, my dear lad? Stevie? Of course! Right here! And this bad tooth. We'll just drop it in the old garbage chute. Now don't you solid foods for six hours! Sure. Louis. Go down the chute. Buy a dousing rod. Why do I have to buy a dousing rod? Why are there blueprints everywhere? And you fucked it. Okay, so they're weaponizing the brains. Makes sense. Oh fuck. Ah, shit. Uh, and how do I do this? Yeah, that's not doing anything. Man, I am so smart. Soft there we go. Underbelly? Here I come. Fuck it. Uh, target lock. Gotta hide behind something. How's that work? Sweet. I need that mental aggression. Lock on me, bitch. Shit. Camera is far too close to me. No fair. I blasted you, tank. Yeah, what Raz said. There we go, David. Can I just punch it? Yeah. Where does more damage as well? One more time. Ah, oh, shit. Well, I fucked that up massively. Okay, you're not going to veer up. No, you are. Die, bitch, die. 
Fuck, that was loud. Oh shit. I'm actually playing. Fuck it, fuck it, fuck it, fuck it. I don't know what's going on because the camera's not very helpful. Fuck. Please let me go from that bit again. Ah, oh, that's not fair. Come on. Whereas, we're getting fucked. That uh, don't need to jump when it's higher up than you. Fuck. Bollocks! Yes, one more flurry, and we're good. I don't think that does anything. There we go. Raz is a bit fucked. Is this a nightmare? Or a plan? Or both? Wait it's like a both. Minute. It's what's his name? It's um. Milton, I'm sorry. I had to abort the experiment. Coach. Something unbelievably urgent has come up, and I must leave immediately. Coach, whatever his name is. You'll never believe. Hold that thought. In a rush. Official psychonaut business. Wait. So is this? Official psychonaut, eh? You forgot your. Hmm. Mine now. Hey, that white room. I know. It's from Oleander's mind. There we go. I That's think I time. was in the coach's dream that whole time. Ever since I stepped through the static in the caravan, it felt funny. I knew I wasn't obsessed with meat. But Mari is. And was stealing psychic brains to arm a fleet of deadly tanks, apparently. I've got to tell Lily. She's waiting for me down by the boathouse. Down by the water? Uh oh. Better hurry. That don't sound good. Can I get to the boathouse through this? Where would you like me to take you, Agent Crawler? Boathouse. It's lake. time to go to the lake. Yes, sir, Admiral, sir. Yes, I am the Admiral. Bobby! Uh-oh. Look, I can explain. Explain what? You haven't done anything. Jeez, it sounds like you caught a bad cold. Maybe. But listen, I traced the psychic interference back to Coach Oleander's radio. He's been broadcasting his insane plot all over camp in his sleep. So he's really kidnapping children and stealing their brains to make weapons. Yes. Isn't that great? No. What? How's How that, that great? Because Thanks, Rez. It's an honest to goodness psychic emergency. And Sasha's not here. He left on some official psychonauts business. Mia left a note saying the same thing. Lily, a deranged man man is building an army of psychic death tanks to take over the world. And there's no one who can stop him except for you and me. Oh my god! Let's make out! Uh, what? Sorry, I'm just so excited. Since you showed Pizza. up, Raz, things are so much more exciting. Sinister death plot and TV. Mad scientists, hideous monsters. Make out. How long have I ignored what this camp had to offer? Everything's new to me now, thanks to you. I mean, look at this flower. You mean like kiss? How many years have I been coming here and I've never even noticed a cool flower like this before? And you're fucked. Boyfriend? Lily. I think Lily might be a little bit psycho. Let's get him! I can't. I can't swim. Well, then use the bathysphere at the end of the dock. Quick! While the flipper prints are still glowing. Are you coming? I don't know how to drive that thing. Uh, I can't. I have to, um, uh, check on the other children. Yes, yes. If the brains are out, they'll need supervision. 
and possibly refrigeration. And how can you not know how to operate a bathysphere? Haven't you ever been to a summer camp before? Now get a move on nope. before that girl gets overly digested. Can I get that? Yes, I can. Why does Lily spell her name wrong? Yeah, 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 I can make two Psychors now. Not Psychors, Challenge Markers. Get in the thing. <coughs> Why is it just the head of a thing? The fuck is that? Let's just go with, it's a psychic air bubble. And you were meant to catch that. Give me the things. Hey, I think I see a piece of teriyaki salmon jerky over there in that clam. Why don't you go eat that instead? What are you? A box of nails. Can I beat this up? That just vanished. Okay, where to go? This way, apparently. Collect all the things. I'm going to assume I have to climb this then. Ah! Yep. Is that going to ring the bell? Yep. Come into my air sphere. Okay, cough up the girl and no one gets hurt, fish. Man, it's gonna be hard to find a new place to give you lumps. You sucking up my air, you dick. Did I do a good or a bad? I cannot tell. Ah! That's... That's how I do it. That makes sense. And that's why there's nails down here. Um... Help! Oh. I thought I was going to be clever and hiding a clam. You know, it's very hard to see what the fuck I'm doing. Uh, where do we go now? Over here. And how long is this going for? Apparently I'm too fast for it. You don't even need to break that. But I will anyway, because I have time. Ah, uh, it's rising. What was that about? You're conveniently opening up a path for me. How nice of you. There's a fish on my head. Didn't quite learn how to attack yet. We start fighting again? Yep. Start sucking in. Do any other things of nails? No. What if I broke that apart? What is the thing of nails? I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die. I'm not gonna die. I'm... I'm good. Whoops. Give me a nice straight path to just follow. Okay, he's not happy. Oh, back to the shit again. You know, if this guy was smart, he'd just drain all the air, and I'd be dead. Okay, he's in. That do anything? No. So, what exactly do I have to do? 
this. I got it. Oh, camera, can you get out of the water, please? How did you not get caught by that? Also, why is there hands there? And I'm gonna die. Again. Okay, let's try this again. There we go. Last one. You already went down. You dick. There we go. I'm a genius. I don't know how that makes me a genius. That poor little thing just tried to kill me about eight different ways. Well, that's not its fault. This was once just a normal-sized lungfish, minding its own business in a mucus-lined air bubble beneath a semi-dry leg bed. But judging by the work done on it, I suspect Maury has mutated it, accelerated its growth, and has placed an implant in its brain to make it do his evil bidding. Whoa. Poor little thing. Yeah, go inside there and try to smash the implant. Use the psycho portal I saw you steal from Sasha's lab. Oh, uh, yeah. That works on big scary monsters? Oh, monster schmonster. That thing's more afraid of you than you are of it. Now get in there! Okay. Whoa. How do I... Poor little thing. There what? we go. I got it. That's a nice brain you got there, um, Lungfish. Ah, top of the morning to you, ma'am. And good day to you, Officer of Lungfish. How are you today? Oh, damp and happy, can't complain. And what are you and the wee one up to on this lovely day? Oh, just obeying the law as always. All posted directives followed to the letter. Ah, good to hear. Not a one of us want any trouble, that's for sure. Ah! Oh, Godzilla! Godzilla, Godzilla, Godzilla. So fuck shit up, yeah? Free lung shit. The lung shit? Yeah, not that. Go to the tower. Where? Also, give me these things. I'm such a dick. I'm just destroying everything. Oh, I can climb. Astral protection, layer restored. Sweet. No, I can't destroy it. Hey, Gogalor! Down here! What up? Excuse me. Were you talking to me? Ah, ow, my ears! I'm sorry. Ah, oh my god! Ah. Are you okay? He's dead. Oh, geez, I'm sorry. Don't worry. Every member of the Resistance is prepared to die fighting the tyranny of Kochamara. What's Kochamara? He's a giant monster like you, Gargalore. He brainwashed and enslaved almost everyone in Lungfishopolis. That stinks. So, hey, have you seen any other humans around here? I'm looking for a girl called Lily. The government archives might have some information about your young girlfriend, Gargalore. Yeah, I don't know if she's really my girlfriend. I mean... I think she... I only meant that she is your friend who was a girl, Gagalore. To access the archives, we must first destroy the broadcast tower Kochamara uses to control the populace. Check. I'll go smash that then. Wait, Gagalore. In order to reach the tower, you'll need to pass through that wall of lasers. But you'll never make it through the lasers without our help. So are you gonna start helping soon? First, I need you to do something for the Resistance. 
Punch a hole in that prison and free my comrades. Can do. No. Freedom. Freedom. Is that like Travi? Freedom. <laughs> now, how about getting me past those gates? Right. We stole the shield power module from Coach Amara. It's too big for any of us to operate, but it should work for you. I just get a shield badge like that. Well, that was easy. Hey, is this gonna upset Cochamera and all your little brainwashed neighbors? No, I doubt it. Almost definitely, yes. No, no. So, knocking down the prison and then breaking this laser shield thing, nobody's gonna get mad about that and start shooting at me. No! Uh, maybe one guy would. But what is even an entire navy of lungfish against the might and revolutionary zeal of Gargalor? Wait, what navy? Meet us at the dam, Gargalor. Even For navy? Freedom! There's like a small lake over there. That's it. Whoops, I crushed someone. The peaceful city of Lungfishopolis is under attack tonight by a hideous, gigantic monster the tank. the terrified citizens have named Gogalore. The Navy has responded quickly and decisively, dispatching its entire tank division to neutralize the creature. Is that Oleander? Kidnapping human children is good. No, it's not. Fuck you. Oleander. Die, bitches. He's just walking. Yeah. Can I move with the shield? No. Whoops. Whoops. Oh, I just broke it with the shields. Fair enough. That's a lot of things. No, you were meant to fucking... Oh, I can pick up a tank. They are doing quite a lot more damage than I thought they would. Be free! Freedom! 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 So, this big monster, is that the best you could do? We were short on time. He is good at smashing things. Doesn't look like much to me. Come on, let's blow this joint. Oh, fuck you, hey, dickhead. You're welcome! Sorry about him, Gargalore. He's been in prison a long time. He's the only pilot the Resistance has, and he has an excellent plan. Meet us at the dam so we can put it into action. I thought I was smashing a tower. Also, how the fuck are you making a fly sideways? That's very impressive. Oh, I thought he was just gonna do a suicide bombing. More news! Well, things have gotten a little embarrassing for Gagalore. Recently surfaced information has strongly linked the previously intimidating monster with common low-life criminals. Earlier tonight, Gagalore broke some of his jailhouse cronies out of the slammer so they could enjoy a night on the town, popping pills and soliciting inexpensive call girls. Well, they're in for one nasty hangover. Our beloved Navy has come up with a high-tech new invention. Trucks armed with hyper-electricity! Kidnapping children do not harm the brains. Okay. That was the wrong button. Okay, that doesn't actually do anything. And I'm dead. I've died a lot. Recently. In these recent times, I have fucked up a shit ton. Ah, you can't get me. You gonna stop anytime soon? There we go. The destruction and terror continue. You never shut up, do you? As the hulking, godless child beast carves a bloody swath through our helpless city. Our noble, all 
volunteer navy has been surprised only by the senseless lust for mayhem that seeps from the twisted black lump of a heart in this creature, still known only as Guggalo. My face is gone. Though it loathes violence in all its forms, the navy has no choice but to activate its anti-monster turrets, which it guarantees are 100% monster-proof. Do not get caught stealing children. I did a lot more damage than I thought it would. I think I figured out where I went wrong. I have a fucking shield. That probably has something to do with how I'm going to take that thing down. I mean, it makes sense. Here we go. See the genius of our plan, Gogalore. First we print flyers, then we spread them all over town with my blimp. Winning over the hearts and minds of Lungfishopolis in as soon as six months. You're not very good at this, are you? Six months. You don't like our plan, you can come up with another one. Blue. Yes, we'll smash we're it. Busy. We have to select cardstock and then find a decent <laughs> but inexpensive printer within the week. Okay, uh, where do we go now? Try prison free pilot. Yeah, I already did that. Use the blimp to get over the dam. Okay. Have you come up with a better plan than the pamphlets yet? Yes! Knock it off! I did it. Uh, they have a battleship. There's a lot of crap around here. And it's kind of hard to see too. How do I get to Skyscraper Island? This is not what I wanted to do. There we go. Oh, you really like your news. We're here with a star of the popular sitcom Trouble in the Bubble, Buddy Finn. Buddy, what's your take on the Gogalore situation? Is he just misunderstood? No way! I hate Gogalore! I can't imagine any one of my fans siding with the monster. He hates everything lungfish care about. Air, water, family, the economy. Buddy, you'll be happy to know that the Navy has decided to pull out what they're most famous for. Airplanes! <laughs> so rest assured, we can all look forward to Gogalore's imminent death. And to seeing you, buddy, every Thursday night at 8, right here on LBC. Thanks, and I'd just like to add that if anyone kidnaps a human child, they should take them quickly under the lake to the abandoned insane asylum. Gogolor, come in. We have commandeered these vessels in your name. We can put them in position to help you cross Cochamara Channel, to get to Cochamara Island, and destroy Cochamara Tower. The thing is that, um, although we have the utmost faith that you will soon contain the area, Gogolor, we, uh... uh we just think it best to do where, uh... We've decided to maintain our position out here. Just until you clear the area of all hostiles. Yes. Oh, thanks. For insurance reasons, Gogolor. Yes, that, and for freedom. So where are the planes? There's eight of them. Okay, that's nice to know. Ah, shit. Well, that one's an idiot and deserve to die. They all kind of deserve to die. Um, getting fucked. Where is the last one? There it is. Just right. There we go. Freedom. Just shield until it kills itself. The other way, I'm well, massive. Couldn't I just walk across it? Miserable and incompetent lungfish navy is all but sunk. Great work, losers. Now, Cochamara himself will have to come all the way down here just to save our worthless hides. Authorities are calling for a big parade in Cochamara's honor after he clobbers the annoying giant Gogalore. And if the parade is big enough, Cochamara promises not to destroy the city. Brush teeth more often, don't drool so much. Hey 
Okay. You know you have psychic powers, yeah? I have a quarter of Give up while you ten. can, Gargalore. I know it's you in there, coach. I don't know where you're broadcasting from, but I'm gonna find out and make you show me what happened to Lily. Kojamara does not speak giant monster boy language. The only word you're gonna need is ouch. Mighty Ram! And I got blocked by a fucking building. Okay. Destroy these. Okay, so that's how I heard him. Okay, just one shot each. Time. Yeah. Oh, you dick. You actually got me. Fuck it. Hmm. So Sasha showed you how to save up your aggressive energy, huh? Well, why don't I help you let it all out? You dick. <laughs> Mighty Ram Ground Vision! Mighty Ram Ground Vision! Okay, what's the next thing? Mighty Ram Ground Vision! Hard to avoid! Every attack! Oh. Okay, so that's just a jump. Over uh, give me some mental aggression, please. Mighty and you dodged the wrong way, you dick. Mighty Ram. Stop dodging the wrong way. Triangle beam. We have to shield a triangle beam, maybe. Mighty Ram. Deadly triangle beam. Yes. Ah, oh, that's what I was meant to do all the time. Probably. Ah, oh, shit! I got hit. Oh. Well, he dead anyway. I got this. Kept forgetting that I had a shield. People of Munfishopolis, I'm sorry I let you down. You should be. You're pathetic. Finally. Okay, Tower. Get ready for Gogalore. Climb the antenna. Can do. Why is this in such a low res? Hey, look, it's a brain. And he's back. Well done, coach. Clever. Fine. Take control of this freaky toad. I don't need him to nab children for me anymore. I've got the brain of a little girl back in my lab that's strong enough to power a whole army of psychoblaster death tanks. Huh? <laughs> what? You've got the brain of a little girl? <laughs> I said, in my lab. I think you've got the muscles of a little girl, too. <laughs> Good one. Woo, I'm a hero. Apparently. Human child. <laughs> who is that? It is I, the creature whose spirit was once, um, <clears throat> over here. Behind you. Yes. Oh. The creature whose spirit was once enslaved by the evil one. You have unchained my soul. And now I shall repay you. Powerful human child. Oh, sweet and powerful. Uh, great. Well, okay. Show me what you did to my friend Lily. By the drowned spirit of Oblongata, it is done. Uh. 
I don't think he meant do the exact same thing. When it is your wish to travel across the lake, you may return to either shore and summon me with that. Thanks, hulking lungfish. You know, you really aren't as hideous as people say. You may call me now by my true name, Rasputin. The name given to me by my people. And what name is that, noble lake creature? Linda. Very what a fitting. Magical lady. Okay. So I'm going to leave this episode here. Thank you guys for watching. If you liked it, leave a like rating and subscribe for more. Bye.